Hey YouTube, Invader51 here. Um, this is my first video. Uh, I just made this channel, so hopefully everything goes good. I made this channel um, to do guides and tutorials on different things like hacks, tweaks, and fixes for the iPhone um, and iOS. I mean, I'm sure all of these will work, or most of these will work on the iPod. Uh, you know, maybe iPad, but for sure the iPhone, because that's what I have to work with. Um, so, since, uh, you know, because of the nature of, you know, my channel and my purpose of making this channel, uh, I will be very open to questions and requests on tutorials and fixes. Um, so make sure you leave you know, requests and stuff uh, in the comment section below. Um, okay, so today I'm going to be showing you how to fix the uh, MMS for T-Mobile um, and Simple Mobile. If you don't know what that is, um, it's a little company. It runs off of T-Mobile Towers. So it's T-Mobile service, but uh, without the contracts. It's forty dollars a month. Um, it's unlimited talk, text, and internet. Uh, it's three G. Um, I believe. No, I'm sure. Uh, the first two hundred and fifty megabytes, uh, they ev of every month, it's uh, they give them to you at four G speeds. So I mean that's pretty cool. It, you know, you could pay I think fifty dollars, and instead of three G, you get unlimited four G or something like that. But uh, whatever. You, you know, you could Google that if you're interested. Simple Mobile. But uh, my point is, uh, it works for that company too. So, if you have Simple Mobile, uh, you came to the right place. Um, as you can see here, I cannot send MMS. Boom, boom, boom. It's grayed out. So, uh, if you're watching this video, most likely your phone is the same way. I got this fix from another YouTuber named uh, Twix Reviews. Um, I googled the subject for a long time, um, and I YouTube, you know, I searched on YouTube, uh, and uh, nobody really had a fix. Uh, when I came across this fix, I was not jailbroken, but uh, I got this phone unlocked. Um, so uh, as of now, I'm not sure if you know there's other YouTubers out there with this method, but uh, this method works even for non-jailbroken devices. So best one for me if you ask me uh, so um this is for iOS 6 any iOS version uh, iOS 6 version I'm sorry not any I don't know if this works for uh, iOS 5 so I mean you could try it but you're not guaranteed for it to work as you can see uh, I am on 6.1.2 uh, my phone reads it as T-Mobile, but I'm not on T-Mobile. I'm on Simple Mobile. My brother's reads it as uh, his iPhone reads it as Simple Mobile, so I don't know, you know, what the difference there is. But uh, so like I mentioned earlier, you don't need a jailbreak for this. Um, all you need to have is a T-Mobile or Simple Mobile. Uh, I'm sorry, the Simple Mobile service. Um, so unlocked, and uh, iOS six. That's it. Um, I've, if you, uh, if you need to unlock your phone, I, I don't think I'm going to make a tutorial on that. Um, it's, it's really simple. Uh, I'm going to make a tutorial on how to jailbreak phones, uh, different versions, but not unlock them because it's really easy. You know, you, once you have Cydia, you download Ultra Snow. It comes by default, I believe. Uh, yeah. You know, very easy. You could Google it. You'll it's super simple um, but uh, yeah you don't need a jailbreak um, but uh, yeah if you do want to unlock your your uh, iPhone um, I've read from several sources that you can actually call AT&T International like their headquarters or whatever and request them to uh, unlock your AT&T iPhone for free um, they do it over the air, so you know, they uh, they remove your IMEI from uh, 
their servers. If you don't know what that is, you know, don't worry about it. They unlock it. Um, but uh, I've never tried this myself. So you would call AT&T the international. You know, AT&T not, you know, the United States because obviously they're not going to want you to unlock it because they want your money. But uh, yeah, you know, you guys could look into that. Um, if it works or if it doesn't, make sure, you know, if you do try it, leave it in the comment section below. Uh, you know, it'd be great to know whether it works or not. Um, so let's get started. Oh, what was it? Settings. Okay. So you guys have to do this in order. I've tried doing this uh, in different orders. It does not work. So... You know, I don't want you guys to be all rude and calling me a dumbass and stuff because it doesn't work for you. You know, most likely, if it doesn't work, it'll be user error. Uh, so just follow this step by step and you should be fine. Just make sure you meet the criteria. Unlocked, Simple Mobile or T-Mobile, and iOS 6. And you should be fine. If it doesn't work, let me know either way. and uh, I'll try to, you know, help you guys fix it, but yeah, should work. I don't know if it works on the iPad, so... You know, don't say anything to me because of that. I'm letting you know. Okay, so first off, make sure Wi Fi is off. Okay, Wi Fi off. You go down to uh, messages. Now, it says uh, MMS messaging. It should show up here. A lot of phones will have it. Uh, if you do make sure it's off okay so off um, uh, it doesn't you can't see it on mine right here it's not here um, that's fine you know it's not really important so for those of you who you know don't have it here it's don't worry about it it's not a big deal just make sure it's off if you do have it so you go up here and you go to general you go to cellular okay so you guys make sure 3G is off and data roaming on. And you go here. Okay. So now for this part, you guys have to spell everything correctly. Uh, you know, one letter and you know it won't work. It'll just give you like an error or just it won't send your stuff, whatever. So it's a uh, EPC dot. T mobile dot com. Now um right here don't put dash. So in this little section right here, you do not put the dash. Um if you put it, you will mess up your phone. And you will not be able to restore it. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know what'll happen, you know, just don't put it. You don't need it. Again, EPC, not T Mobile. Dot com. Oh. Username and password, always leave it uh, blank. Yeah, you don't need anything on there. MMSC, it's HTTP dash dash. Okay, now this, you guys pay attention. If you have simple mobile, you will start off with this S M P L oh, P L dot. That's what you will start with. Okay. If you don't have Simple Mobile, you'll just go ahead and start with the uh, what was it M M S. Okay. So if you have Simple Mobile, you put S M P L dot. If you don't, you just start off with M M S. Okay. So it's M M S dot. MSG dot ENG dot T Mobile dash dot com uh, slash MMS slash WAPENC. Okay, so oh, as you might have noticed, you do put the dash here. So don't forget that. 
for this part you do need the dash. Um, MMS proxy. It's two one six dot one five five dot one six five dot fifty. And then this thing, I forget what it's called, and it's eighty eighty. Uh, MMS max size, it is one oh four. Mm, 8546. Yeah. And this MMS UA prof URL, it is HTTP, this thingy again, slash slash, oh, it's www.apple.com slash MMS slash UAPROF, UAPROF dot RDF. Okay, now internet tethering, same thing, EPC dot T Mobile dot com. And username and password blank. So just make sure you know you didn't misspell anything. Uh, everything's fine. Like I said, uh, if if you're on um, T Mobile, you do not need this uh, simple part. Uh, that's only for simple mobile users, you know, just take that out. Or don't type it in to begin with. <laughs> okay, so now once you're done with that, you want to go back, you go to messages, and you see now you will see this MMS messaging. So if you had it off before, you know, turn it on. If you have it now, make sure it's on. Um, now, you go ahead and you check your messages here and as you can see you are now able to send MMS and also receive it um, so yeah that is the end of the tutorial um, another part you know a lot of people I, well, I saw it on the comments on uh, Twix reviews a lot of people were asking uh, if you could turn it back on the, uh, the 3G and stuff Oops, this one. Yes, you should. Um, you could turn this off if you want. Uh, I leave it on, you know, because it doesn't matter. I don't have a contract and they don't have my name, so it's not like they're going to charge me anything extra just for the hell of it. Um, so, yeah, that pretty much ends the uh, tutorial. So, uh, you guys, um, rate comment and subscribe make sure you leave questions and requests in the comment sections um, so hopefully uh, I'll be able to do tutorials on your requests and questions um, yeah so if you see anything on my phone that you like uh, you know little tweaks that I might not have paid attention to or something uh, you know make sure you go ahead and ask about that if you'd like um, and yeah, I will be back soon.